happy to be able to tell you that in Lantuina, the Ravello's men are out, Ooh. Rico and the Rebellion are in. Well, so go ahead and scroll Pachi on a nearby wall. It would feel nice. No, that's not good. Oh. <laughs> it only fell on her arm. Then if, if anybody comes by here, they're just gonna be like, what ha the heck happened? Oh, it was just a freak garbage can accident. It's normal. She was a garbage woman, she realized it. She realized the risks involved. <laughs> oh boy. Well, I wonder, like, this might be a good place to end for now, but I was wondering, like, I might forget to do these things later, so I, I gotta make a tough decision here. With, with garbage cans. Garbage can decisions. Well, I'm gonna do some racing. And if things take too long, well, if they, things don't take long enough, then there's always more places to- oh, no. It's a good thing there was no physics on that. Oh, they're back! You know what? Yeah, you know who is that actually back? The invisible air guitarist musicians. Whoa, what's going on over here? What's, what's so interesting about this one man? Oh, it's because they all want to get the autograph of Luigi. Can I have your autograph? Oh, he just got frozen for a second there. Yeah, they all just are staring at him really, really rudely. Come on, guys. Shouldn't be staring. This, though. I just need to do a little bit of, uh... Bowling. Bowling dominoes. One or the other or both. Oh, what? The angling of these things sometimes just make no sense. Oh no. Go, go, go! Oh, It's probably because of the fact that, like, the garbage can is a little bit, uh, obtuse. It's not a cute... Not a cute little garbage can. Oh well. Going down. Time to sprint. AKA, race. What kind of race is this? Ooh, that looks like a pretty fancy vehicle. I still... Hey, it does actually let me choose some nicer ones. Cause I could... I could have my weaponized vehicle, but I think I'll just have a, a fairly normal... Serpent. Or actually, no, I want to use this one, cause I haven't used this vehicle in a long time, I think. It's the... Quiposa. Miguelo. Gotta get going with that. Oh, see, it doesn't really look as nice with this kind of g color green, though. That's the one thing. But I think that uh, if we were going to consult Surge Hunter on the whole aspect of vehicles, he'd probably say, like, this is a fairly normal color for this car. I don't know. <laughs> probably. Start off with a bang! Yes! Okay, I'm gonna definitely get uh, all the gears on this one. Because... Oh, I was just gonna bounce over top of that vehicle, too. Yeah. This race was not designed for a vehicle of this spectacularness and magnitude. Being able to jump through the air. Oh boy. I, I can already say that this is an amazing race. Not the TV show. <laughs> but... If they wanted to do this kind of thing on their show, that probably would be very much illegal. Unless they, like, got a lot of pre-approval by... The Senate. Yep. Um. And, uh, yeah. Time to race! Downhill. Oh, no. Woo! It's all good. See, it's all about just going really, really fast, like, point to point. It's like all the really aggressive, dr aggressive drivers that are on the roads that everybody hates, but nobody wants to say it because they're all a bunch of cowards. But, yeah. They... They drive really, really fast, and then they see a stoplight and just stop instantly. Nope, their brakes actually work. Which... Ooh! I had to end with fashion and style. Oh! <laughs> it's so fast! Slow motion fastness! Okay, I have that unlocked. What's the next unlock? Faster in-air recharge. Don't know if that's useful at all. But... Maybe in a boat. In a boat it looks like it might be useful. 
in air recharge of just flying through the air with off of a jump makes no sense, so. Who knows? Okay. Well, that was a good race. Whoa! Oh, and I'm back to my good old-fashioned village. Which, I need to do something. While I'm in the area here. Okay. What you do? Actually, I want to do things uh, more... No, 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 I want to do things... The other way. Oh. Well, hopefully these don't despawn. Because this is going to be spectacular. Possibly. Probably not at the same time, but... Here we go. Now it's time to rip some things down and... Oh, no! Go! <laughs> Why was I flying? I'm like a kite. Kite car. Man, that is awesome. Well... I guess that those are, uh, just a bunch of immovable objects. They're made out of really, really strong magnets. I don't know what they're actually called for the special magnets that just, like, are not possible to get rid of at all, but, uh, not glass grenades. I, oh, oh no. I will give myself the vehicle restock even though I don't think I'll ever need it, because I don't do that kind of thing. Land vehicles, uh... Oh, half the time. Yeah, why not? And then, anything else that's special? Beacons? So, nitrous and turbo jump recharge much faster when in the air. Land and sea vehicles. Yeah. Turbo jump to... Oh, I think there's a faster version of nitrous. Nitrous on all vehicles recharges... Oh, it just re recharges faster, okay. Yeah, that would be the thing to be going for. All the rest of them just don't seem like they're that much special at all. Oh well. Oh boy. I'm actually pretty far away from where I want to go. So I need to go flying. I could fast travel, but nah, I think that it's worth it just to regular travel, just to smell the delightful air that's rushing through his nostrils and just everything else in between. <laughs> While he flies through the air. It's the best way of going. Because who doesn't want to travel using a parachute? Which would make a little bit no sense, but at the same time it does. It definitely makes a lot more sense than the weird physics that he was trying to do while blowing up a giant weapon in the air. But oh well. It is fine. Okay. Because at this point... Oh, I didn't actually do it. I was trying to grab and grapple. So I could also do this while I'm going. <laughs> That's what Rico does for fun while he just like flies and is traveling. That's why he doesn't like to take like registered uh, travel systems. Partially because nobody wants to travel with him. Because <laughs> he always uh, just grapples people together and stuff like that. And he's just kind of a jerk. But, at the same time, is because then he can't be a jerk if he's actually on regular transportation systems of, like, being inside of a plane or something. So then he's just... He's so restricted, he's not able to just shoot his grappling hook outside of the plane and grapple it to things. Grapple the birds together that are going by. Oh, here we go. I'm almost there. I have a feeling this is going to be a pretty amazing wingsuit uh, race thing here. Oh no! Oh. Go, 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 go! Well... This is not gonna end well. <laughs> oh, no, please. I'm just gonna angle it th this way around so then it looks more epic. Oh. There we go. He only has, like, second degree rug burns, it's fine. If that's even, uh, if you can designate rug burns as any sort of things like that. Ah, well. But yeah, they don't have enough wingsuit courses, it seems like. But now I can finally go back, have more wingsuits, and enjoy the ride. Oh wow, there's like not even any loading for that. Oh. Well, now it's gonna have to load. I thought it was because of the fact that, like, they say that when you just, like, start up the game, then it has less loading screens. It takes lo- it, it takes longer to load the longer that you're in the game. 
But it does not matter. Who needs to care about loading when you can have a front loader? Oh no. I thought that I was going a little bit closer to the ground than I was going to there. No. Okay, I need to try that again. I got this. I think I know what I have to do here. You go straight down in the ground, face plant, but then you don't... Oh, you got a low altitude bonus. Nice. Oh, did I actually get a couple gears from that? I think I did. I wasn't paying attention. Hey, I got one gear. If you can get one gear just by face planting into the ground, then that's pretty impressive. It's like a consolation prize. Still, speaking of the Olympics, that's what they should be doing. They just give everybody a medal just for fun. It's not a good medal. It's like made out of like tin cans or something like that. Recycled tin cans. But... It would at least be a good, like, it's a good gesture. And then you could, they can put stuff in their metals, because they are quite literally tin cans that are just recycled. They're not even clean, they're just like, they smell like beans and stuff like that. Oh no. Ah, oh, I missed. Well. How did I do, like... I think it's because I was going perfect through the rings the last time, that's why I couldn't really... I would have to grapple if I was going to be doing things like that. Which I'm going to probably have to grapple right now, but... Let's... Yeah, here we go. That's the grapple point. I think I'm good now. You just have to live and breathe the wingsuit. Gotta make sure that it's sentient. Ow. Okay. Well, that was a really weird angle. I think if you just win this one, you get five years. Because this is actually a really tough course. Reel and kick. One? Oh, maybe I can actually charge it up. Oh. Okay. Eight more... Air brake? That might be useful. I don't know. One more try. I got this. Probably. I don't know. They, they're putting me through these really crazy tests right now, though. They're making me have to do a... What do you call those? It's like an SAT? Is that what the Americans have? while flying through the air, and at the same time I have beer goggles on. I don't know why I have beer goggles on. They just kind of... They appeared on my head at one point. I was just in the helicopter, I just fell asleep for a little bit, and then... I just jumped out of the plane and realized, oh wait! They put beer, bo beer goggles on me! Why? Why would they do this to a poor little... guy that wants to wingsuit? Who knows? But that's just the way they do things here in uh, Medici. Okay. I gotta go great on that one just so I can... Wait, that was totally perfect. Come on. I ate those Doritos perfectly. And if they say otherwise, they just don't know what they're talking about. Because I'm the professional Dorito eater. Just like all the Halo people do. Okay, that was probably not a good idea. Oh well. If I just get a couple greats, then that's gonna be okay, I think. Okay. Because this one's probably gonna have to be a great. Just like Tony the Tiger always said. Tony Tiger always said there'd be days like this. Okay, well... I don't know if you get more just for going fast, but I was assuming that you did. And I probably shouldn't have got great for that. Wait! No way! Yeah, I guess it is just all about completing it for some of them. Because the more intense the challenge, the less... Intense, the perfects you have to get. Which I say that is pretty impressive. Yeah, okay, well. Oh no! <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. Wait, what is this place? Oh boy. This looks really destructible and delicious. Porto Le Gre Gretia. Gratia, I'd say that. Let's do it. This is a massive military base, though. And... Emporium of... Giant containers to be shipping a mass quantities of cereal to people. Oh boy, I don't think I can do anything here. At least in a sense that, like, this is gonna take weight. Oh, I gotta do this first and foremost. Uh, reeling into enemies launches them a bit farther. 
That's all it is. I was hoping that I would be able to uh, just use my... Actually, I think I was able to use that anyway. Just like my tether, like reel in fast thing. Okay, well, it's probably still worth it. Either way, I still think this is probably a good place to end because of the fact that like... That's a massive area. Look at that porto. And I think there's only... There's probably only those two things left in this area, and then I have this entire island liberated, and then I just have to do those other two, because I want this entire region. This region has to be liberated. If it doesn't, then... I'm just doing it wrong. And after this uh, thing is done, then... I'll only... I, I still want to say that I'm only going to liberate what's necessary of the rest, but... Who knows? I'm getting through the missions, because next time I am going to be doing that mission, definitely. I'm going to liberate my way there, probably. And then I'll do a mission, and then another mission. And then if there's another mission down here, I hope so. Just going to hope. Hoping is always the best way of doing things. Either way, still. Goodbye for now.